You get a plane, you parachute down to the island. That's what I'm talking about! Uh, jump blind? That's risky. Oh, come on. It is, it's risky! By the way, who's that guy? Come on, dude. With that hat. Like such a pussy. Is, uh, Who is he? Now we have to do it. We're in. So where's this island? I wonder what island they're talking about. It, it says it's not a mystery whatsoever because, yeah. Oh, where did I wake up today? Oh boy. But I'm, I think that might be the last pill because we don't save anybody else throughout the game. So really, I think this is basically the last time we really ever come back here. Or really forced to come back here. Ah. Exit the cave. I will do that. I, should, I might be able to go fight that bear, but all that's back there is a relic. And I don't really care enough to get that. Unless, looking at the handbook. Uh, ye, signature weapon. No, we need a ton more. Look at all these relics we need to even get the first one. So really, I don't... We're probably never going to even get to it. And by the time we do get to it, it'll basically be uh, the end of the game anyway. So, I probably shouldn't even really bother with it. I hope there's another dance section at some point later in the game. Oh, we gotta bring the knife to Citra. Okay. What would happen if we never got the knife? And like, like we had the knife, we gave it the buck, and everything was just fine. What would you do to Citra? It's like, by the way, this one guy has a knife. You can go, and, I guess, go invade his house and take the knife if you want. I don't know. Or maybe we could just walk up, but we were at Buck's house and just shoot him in the face. Like that, that could have worked too. Like Jason did have like four guns. You didn't need to get into a knife fight with the guy. You usually could have just like pulled out your shotgun and shot him. It's nice that they have like automatic doors like they do have like at grocery stores or their ancient temple. Hello, brother. I still can't take any tribe seriously if they're using AK forty seven. Jason. I had nearly forgotten your face. I'm glad to see you. The knife. It is in your hands. Do you mean this knife? To us that which he didn't he didn't bring out the knife. So it didn't really work as well. So I wanted it too. See, if you did that a bit earlier, it could have worked out better. It has been conquered. The dead have been avenged. Come with me. I don't think they've been avenged at that Leave point. Us. Just because you took a knife that stabbed someone doesn't make them avenged. Jason's a really slow walker. And there seems to be a lot more stairs than there were before. By how many times like the camera's going up. What is it you desire? To save my friends. You already saved them! Are you sure? I want to kill Voss and Hoyt. Once, long ago. There was a lotus pond filled with clean water. The bank composed of smooth sand. The smell of blossoms moved the air. But a giant lived beneath the pond's surface, devouring any who came to its edge. How does a giant live underneath a pond? A warrior from the Northern Kingdom heard of the giant and vowed to slay him. Paint Tata on his body power from the land of the dead. And when he was ready, he walked the path of the lotus pond. The giant rose from still waters, and the warrior raised his dagger. He cut the giant's head clean off its body. The skull of the giant fell to earth and became our island. The descendants of the warrior became the Rakyat. I think you're just crazy. Now another giant has risen. Prove you are worthy of the Tata. Have we not done that yet? Help us free our captive warriors. And I will give you the power you desire. Okay then. And I will see you again soon. Warrior. 
What's the definition of a warrior? Because it's it, it checks you got a large list of demands before you meet the definition of a warrior. I'm pretty sure it's just like a guy who fights in a war. Is that like the definition of a warrior? I think so. And apparently I can't fast travel out of here because I probably need to leave the temple before it even Hello, gives me brother. the next objective, so I can't just teleport out. I don't think that works. If this is just a cutscene. Yes, sir. We are leading an attack against a convoy of prisoners taken by bots. Wait, what's the plan? And Kill them all. Go we'll meet the men that you will be working with. They're in church town. They'll be very happy to help you. Is that a place? Isn't there only two towns? Oh, do I have three skill points? I did not know that. Do I have anything good to even get? No, I need more missions for that. I need more missions for that. Okay. Move faster when crouched. That might be useful. So I will get that. Uh, really just noise when walking and sprinting. That also might be useful at some point in the future. Probably not. Something to go to church town. I'm pretty sure every time. Every. It just seems like they just make new towns every few missions. Or at least I never noticed these towns before when I was driving by. That might also be the case. Okay. Uh, I need ammo for one. For one thing, I need that ammo. 155 bucks, okay. Ammo, get all of it. 20% discount, nice. Got 70 bucks left, that's enough to get what? I don't, I don't know, something up 70 bucks. Like, maybe a new copy of our game. Ubisoft, that guy, he did that. Good on him. Uh, I wanted, I wish I could drive this somehow. But I don't think that would... I don't think that's in the cards. Now where is Church Town? It is that way. So now let's go up and around the mountain. That seems to be the fastest and easiest approach to this. Hopefully there's no tigers or anything that want me dead. But that would not surprise me in the least. Is this really refilling my ammo? I still, I still got like nothing. And there's more water buffalo. And peacocks. This map's full of water buffalo. There's water buffalo in every angle of this island. Don't you charge at me. Don't. That didn't work. The grenade did not work. Okay, more water buffalo. How do you... Okay, this island is pure... There's more water buffalo than people per square kilometer on this island. And there's a dog chasing me. There's another one. Apparently, he did not watch his other friend get blown up by a shotgun. What happened to this guy? Well, he's not gonna have a truck anymore. Because now it's underwater. Goodbye, truck. It was an honor knowing you. I can still see it, never mind. It's much less dramatic when you can still see it when it's underneath the water. There's just a raft over there. Oh, it's like a zip liney thing. Okay. Don't know why you'd make that in the first place and not have it just go all the way across the uh, place. All across the lake. And this is called Church Down because I assume there's a church in it right there. I assume that's... You're naming the entire city based off the structures inside of it. That's like calling, I, I don't know, New York City a tall skyscraper. I don't know. I don't know. Hey, guy. Are you planting bombs here, in the Jason. church? Vasa's trucks pass through town. We have to plant the explosives to block the road. Give me the C4. I'll do it. Nice Hell tattoos yeah. over your face. Okay. The music. The music's getting all musicy. I don't even have a time limit. I have all the time in the world. To plant the C4. That's not even C4. Is that C4? That looks like just normal dynamite. Hello? Hey, Jason, it's Lisa. I'm kind of busy. What's up? Just letting you know that the boat's coming along. When are you back here? I'm not sure. You are coming back, right? Yeah. Okay. See you soon. Lisa, you don't, don't gotta worry. Me. Everything's gonna be okay. Unless you die, then it's not gonna be okay. Okay, where's the good, super good sniper rifle? There we go. Now this is a super nice sniper rifle, and I'm pretty sure it comes with the extended uh, clip. 
stay inside the water tower until the convoy is ambushed. Okay. Those guys aren't pirates. They don't look like Voss's men. What do they look like? They are guys in yellow uniforms. And they blew up. What the hell are these guys? These guys look organized. They look okay. like soldiers or something. Yes, they do indeed look like soldiers, and a lot of them, they're really good at getting shot by the one and only Jason Barote. That guy, oh, he's going on a collision course to death. Okay. See, this guy, ah, don't do that. Don't avoid my bullets. There we go, right in the kneecap. Okay, I got one bullet. Gotta make it count. There we go. But I still have ten more, so... Do I have any more ammo around here? No, I just got wine bottles. Okay. Oh, uh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I didn't get a nut shot. Uh, where are these other guys coming from? There's some guys on the truck. I wonder if I can throw a grenade over there. Renata! Wow, okay. Well, I hit, blew up that truck. That's basically the same one. How did I miss that? How did I miss? Okay. Okay, got them. Got them. Oh! I'm missing. I'm awful. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to go down. There's like a quick slide, right? No, this is a quick slide. Okay, just get out the light machine gun and we're ready to go to town. Against all the yellow guys. That sounds a little bit racist. But they're wearing yellow, so it's completely justified. Renata! Okay. You're dead. You're dead. 